Hello friends, welcome to my channel Go Digit. Well, this is the second part of the VAT or Deferred uh, Unrealized VAT series. In this video, uh, in this part, we will see how to post the purchase invoice with Unrealized VAT. Okay. So to do that, let me uh, create a new purchase invoice. Select the vendor name. Just input the vendor invoice number. Select type payable right term. Now we have to search for the VAT field. Open the invoice again and just change here the VAT product posting group as deferred VAT. Okay. So if I click the set the stitch button, we will see that our the invoice uh, is having an amount of one thousand and the ten percent VAT is of hundred. But when we post this invoice. Uh, the VAT will be posted in unrealized form okay so let me click on the preview posting and if we see the VAT entry here this is the VAT ledger and if we see this VAT ledger we will see the amount is showing zero here why so because uh, the VAT is in unrealized form if I zoom this and check the unrealized amount field and see the this is the field which is having the VAT amount and it is showing as 100 as unrealized amount. So this means that now whenever we post an invoice with having the VAT product posting group as deferred VAT, uh, the invoice will be posted uh, with unrealized VAT. Okay. And once when we do the payment of this invoice, then only the VAT amount will be uh, converted from unrealized form into the realized form. And so to do to check that first we have to post this purchase invoice. So let me click this post button and just saying do you want to open the poster invoice I will click yes and click on navigate here we will see again the VAT ledger is zero okay and the underlies amount is showing 100 okay and now if I check my GL entry also so you will find that the VAT of 100 is posted in the in this ledger in this GL account 5630 which we have assigned in the purchase VAT underlies account in the VAT posting setup window so we can check that also just go to the setup part of the deferred VAT and here this is the purchase VAT underlies account 5630 the system correctly posted the underlies VAT amount in this account. So now in the next part of the video when we post the payment of this invoice, uh, system will transfer the 100 amount from this account to this realized VAT account. Okay. So thank you very much guys. If you like this video, please click the like button and hit the subscribe button. Thank you so much.